Good morning, Detector Rats. I am out here at my sandbar permission. I've uh, been here recently, uh, but I've come back because people get out here and they lose a lot of stuff. And so I want to see what I can find with all the Christmas parties and everything like that that's been going on. And so uh, let's get out there, see what we can find. I want to give a big shout out to Will, the manager. Uh, who gave me permission to come down here and do this little hunt. All right, I'll see you at the first hole. Thanks. Okay, first target out here. Nice nickel. Let's get rolling. Quarter for the second target. I got a couple more pennies, just hit another quarter, moving fast, trying to stay ahead of the uh, morning crew here that's out here to rake things and make it look good for, for today, so I'm on the move. Alright, been getting on the pennies and quarters, just got a dime, hopefully there's a few more dimes out there. Alright, staying ahead of everybody. Alright, I've been getting lots of pennies, got a few more dimes. The rake crew is over there just on the other side of that building, they're trying to rake the sand out. They get rid of all the trash and stuff, so I'm trying to stay ahead of them and moving quick. Deep signal there, just got a nice quarter. All right, moving like a flash. But ba boom, boom, another quarter. I'm in a section that they do last now, so I'm far enough ahead of the crew that I can slow down and really hit every signal I get. Hopefully there'll be some kind of jewelry piece out here, even like a little junk earring would be nice. But I'm happy getting change. <clears throat> Really funky signal came out of that hole. Got a quarter and a washer. Awesome stuff. Okay, this is why I come out here. This one's a heart stopper. Best one I've ever found. Look at that beauty. Look at how shiny it is. I mean, absolutely perfect condition. Look at the word copy stamped on the other side. Dang! Oh. Always that close, but uh, out of all the fake Spanish coins I've found, this one is in the best condition. Probably a very recent drop. You can see the seam on the edge, which is not indicative of a, a real coin anyway. So even without the word copy, you know, if you see that seam at the edge, you know you're dealing with a fake. But uh, that's beautiful. I'm going to enjoy owning that. Hopefully there's a few more out here. <laughs> And just like that, right under the surface here, just had to brush away some dirt. You find another one of those, you can see where it says copy on it. And uh, yeah, it says copy down there by my thumb. And this is the average condition that I find them in. A lot of times I find them worse. But I've never found a shiny one like that other one before, so that's just really exciting for me. And right there, this one makes number three. On the, the fake coins, you can see where it says copy on that one. So, I've got a fake Spanish silver pocket spill, because they were all right in this area here. That's just amazing. Awesome stuff. Come to the other side of that same chair. Very first signal, another copy. That makes four. This is my best day for fake coins ever. Under this chair, number five. Man, this is a stellar day for me. I know they're fake coins, but you have no idea how excited I am about this. Boom, second chair. It's number six, I think. Another shiny one here. That's like number seven. <laughs> awesome. People were playing around with these out here. I'm going to dig all of them that I can. <clears throat> all right, I've pulled about a dozen Spanish coins, the fake ones, of course. And uh, finally, I get me a real nickel. Now, don't get me wrong, I love those fake Spanish coins. I'll pull a hundred more of them if I can. This area out here is usually reserved for weddings and parties and receptions and stuff like that. So, must have been some type of giveaway or table decoration or something that the kids were all playing with. Because they're just all over in this area. And I hope to find more. Alright, I'm still moving along. 
Let me another copy. This one's got a gold color to it. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright. Almost done here. Alright. Time for the Park Rat Rapid Roundup. I got some decent trash out of that place for sure. Lots of nails. Bottle caps. Got a few of these little bits right here which actually turn out to be part of champagne bottle caps. You know that piece that covers the cork. Uh, I got this little twist lock here. It's like for a canopy. Another one of those weird pen clips. Uh, somebody's vape something chamber. Who knows? Ew. And lots of little random scrap metal there. I ended up with three dollars and forty one cents in clad we got thirty one pennies no Wheaties in the bunch we got ten quarters five dimes and two nickels had a lot of fun digging all of them and then of course the heyday of the day for me was getting twenty count them twenty fake Spanish coins and you can see where they all have copy stamped on them a lot of the coins I find don't have copies stamped on them because they're not actually copies of coins. They're just made to look like coins so they don't legally have to have copies stamped on them. But these are all copies of actual Spanish coins. We get a couple here that are in the gold tone, brass tone, a few that are like real high silver looking, and then the rest all dull gray, lettish looking. And I had found out they had had some event going on out there. And these have been buried out there for the kids to find for prizes. And of course, they weren't all found. And even after the staff went through and sifted everything out, they still managed to leave these behind. That was a beautiful day for me. I've found the fake coins before, but I've never found so many in one run. I absolutely love it. And um, even though none of them are perfect, they've all got their little dulled out areas and stuff from being in the sand I may actually uh, use some of these as giveaway items in the future just because <laughs> this is not something you're gonna find sitting in the middle of a park in Montana or wherever it is you're from so that was my wrap up I had a fun day good three hours out there hope you all had an awesome time too remember to like share and subscribe Check out my Christmas giveaway video. Leave a comment there if you want to be eligible to win a silver coin on uh, Christmas Eve. Alrighty, I'll see you in the next video. God bless.